Alright, yeah, and welcome back to some more Two Point Hospital. So, why are we getting such a backlog Terrible on this area here? You could lose a toe. Can I move your house. people over? Oh, oh my god. Oh! Even your light. Oh, it's a brow! <laughs> I got an achievement for low brow. We just had somebody's eyebrow crawling across the uh, across the floor. Brilliant. <laughs> Swindles. It's funny. Uh, my my dad used to call Swinton Insurance Swindle Insurance because they're uh, ridiculously priced. So I like that. Um, we could train somebody. In, oh no, we need to train a nurse today, don't we? Uh, we got a junior nurse. I think it was Alexa Almore that needed a training session. So, in fact, trainees available. Alexa. And then, what do we want to train her in? Um, do pharmacy management. Motivation, speed and efficiency seems like a good one. Um... Increases happiness of patients when dealing with them. General. Oh, we could just go do more ward management, I think. Uh, we're going to have to bring in a trainee for this, but we'll do that. 10,000 plus 10,000 per trainee, so... One trainee is just 10,000. Could upgrade your ward management, but we're going to need some backup nurses while we do that. And you are a senior nurse. I think I'm just going to leave it with one. Uh, we've got... The task to train two more staff. I mean, I could have included them there. Promote three staff. Staff gain experience as they work. They're ready for promotion when they've got ex enough experience when they complete some training. All right. You're a head janitor. Can I just like promote you? No. Ooh. Oh, he's got it. He's already on it. All right. <gasps> There's a bin there, you savages. I guess we need some more bins. Let's get one on this corner here. We've got one in the middle there. Maybe they're just not being emptied. That's a possibility, I suppose. Let's get one there. Oh. Oh, I see a brow. I got a brow. Take that brow. Yeah, we definitely need another janitor, I think. This is just... This is getting out of hand. We'll just get uh, Adam Nerd, who used to live in the Pointy Mountains. And thinks her life is rom-com. I feel like we're getting a little bit um, away from ourselves. Oh, God. Do we need a third GP's office? I suppose we could have one over here. Uh, let's, uh, let's pick up and move this plant. And let's get a GP's office in this area. Since this area is going to fill up with stuff anyway. Most likely. So, let's get you in there. Yeah, this in corner. Need a filing cabinet. There we go. Let's have a bookcase in the corner there. I want that chair. Where's that chair? There we go. Spectator. And this guy's really qualified. So he's getting lots of certificates. And he needs to look important. So here's a Rorschach poster. Let's get some windows in here as well. Ooh, do we get to see the uh, the clown thing? Let's have a look. See. The lone voice of reason, ready to spread some truth to all our vigilant listeners. So open your eyes and your ears. <laughs> get ready to find out what's really going on. But first. Oh. You gotta cure the happiness out of them. Because they're too happy. That's brilliant. Ooh, career goal achieved. We got a million dollars. How's our, uh... We're earning 8,000. That's okay. Special report. We managed to complete our challenge from last episode. That's nice. Uh, let's see. Cooper Do Doolittle. Senior nurse. It would be great to work in a really spacious environment with lots of luxury furnishing, something really prestigious. Getting a level four toilet. Uh, yeah, sure, why not? We'll uh, fill this area. We also seem to be lacking any sort of plant care. 
Could we focus on that, please? Because these plants are dying. So we want a really prestigious toilet. Sadly, I don't have the golden toilet. Or at least I don't think I do. Let's have a look. Do I have to unlock it, or is it... No, I don't have it. Dang it. Alright, let's get some toilet cubicles. Let's actually get like a, a cubicle area. Like so. Uh, we're prestige level 2, so we want a, a bin and a plant. In this area we're gonna have some sinks. I guess we could have some sinks at this side as well. And some hand dryers on the way out. Right. So now we need to furnish this area and get it to prestige level 4. That is... That is quite the task. Maybe we can spend some kudosh to get there? Uh, just posters, really. A clock. Let's get a clock in there. I'll put you there. Hmm. Yeah, this needs a little bit more than what we've got. Let's get some plants down the back, I guess. Ah, oh, it's just... Hmm. It's too much. We needed, like, a drinking fountain or something like that. I mean, we could spam posters, but I really don't want to just, like, spam things for the sake of it. Just to get our skill. We are close, though. Could I get a chair in here? Yeah. Gosh darn it. Uh, we're so close. So close. Can I just, like, get a plant? Yeah, that takes it over the limit. Alright, now let's find a reasonable space for all of this stuff. I guess we could do that and leave it like that. Prestigious toilet, done. Alright, we need to train one more staff member. So, let's start a training course. Have we promoted anyone yet? No, hang on. How do we promote? Fire, take a break. Promote, there we go. Alright, let's up you a little bit. There we go. Training required. Oh, we could train her now. Yeah, sure. Let's do that. So she's a student doctor. Let's see who we can get involved. <laughs> what is that? That looks like a butt crack. Um, let's see. What could a head janitor... Uh, I suppose a head janitor trains a uh, training master class. Let's get her trained in diagnostics, I guess. Start the training. Okay. Ooh, what's this? Hygiene. Yeah, looking very hygienic. Good. Uh, you need the toilet pretty badly. We now have a luxury toilet, though, so you've got really no excuse. Doo -doo -doo. Um, staff list. Use the staff list to quickly find people based on their job. I'm looking for people who need a promotion, because we can promote two people. Um, so I could go down this list and see if a star turns up on the right there. For people. Uh, you need a train. Some training. Doo -doo -doo. What's this? Oh, is this a doctor name? I don't know. Register your body for compost donation today. Hmm. Compared to online rivals, our hospital has the staff morale with a score of 73%. Nice. Uh, so we've got somebody visiting cardiology now. There's our... Uh, our lovely inspector. Yeah, he's loving it. Sweet. Okay. Training required. We cannot train you, because I believe we are already training someone. Uh, we got our stuff, so we got some kudosh, we got some happiness, and... An increase in rewards, and we can't train you either because we don't have the space. But we are currently getting Ava Courgette a nice little boost. 
Oh, 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 we got a brow. We got a brow. Dead brow. Oh, no, more brows. Oh, God. I was going to say, what the hell are you doing? And I remembered, you're a janitor. That's your job. You know what would be really funny? If they had um, Theme Park, the original's uh, opening trailer on that. Because in the opening cinematic, they're actually uh, watching television and they get sucked into it. Hmm. Might be a quite nice little nod, though. I imagine they have to deal with uh, possible trademarking stuff, even though Bullfrog no longer exists. And many of the people who worked on Theme Hospital in the same company worked on this game. But still. Alright, you might be ready for a promotion now. You are. Sweet. Let's promote you. Boom. Somebody just died. Oh. I thought it was one of our janitors for a second. And here. Uh, she's dying, but she's feeling nauseous. She was being treated for verbal diarrhea. <laughs> well, at least we got plenty of Ghostbusters. I mean, uh, ghost capturers. Gotta get it right. Okay, one more training. Let's see, trainees. Let's get a, a junior nurse in, shall we? And let's see. What could we train you in? Senior nurse can train you in. You got motivation. I'll give you diagnostics because I'm not sure where you're actually currently working. So that seems like it'd be a good all-round skill to have. Oh, what's up with you? Were you being chased by a brow? Was that the issue? Hmm. Looking for work. I bet I can find you some. Don't make me start looking for it. Alright. Let's get some uh, stuff in this area here as well. I've got a drinks machine, but I don't have a snacks machine. So let's get one of those in. Right there. Let's get a bin. We also need some entertainment as well. So let me get a bench and find some entertainment for you. Leaflet stand is the go-to at the moment. I suppose we could also have a bookcase. And then pretty up a little bit with a plant because it's a barren wasteland at the moment. It's a little cramped as well though. Uh, I guess we're having posters. Let's get a poster there, right behind you. Pretty up that corridor a little bit that we can't fill. Health Minister is visiting the Clown Clinic. <laughs> is he having a laugh? <laughs> oh my god, that's brilliant. Or is it because there's a line and nobody there? I don't know. Oh my god, look at that brow. This game's so cool. I love it. Ooh, we've almost got that nurse ready to promote. So, she's learnt. And she's been promoted. Boop. Alright. We've done it. Sweet. One star hospital. Congratulations, your hospital has been awarded a one star rating by the two point health ministry. You're getting rather good at this, I see and showing signs of an ability to develop staff from within. How terribly promising, which is to say, how terrible. Stay there to nurture this fledgling talent or abandon it altogether and move on to pastures new in our chilly northern region. I think I'm actually going to stick around in this particular one. Oh, we've actually not two hospitals. I'm going to stick around in this one and get ourselves a two-star hospital, I think. Um, that's going to be what do we do today. So let's continue, shall we? We've unlocked a clown poster and a reception. Ooh. Patients register here after arriving at the hospital. Every journey begins somewhere. Oh, is it like a... Oh, it's like a, an actual help desk kind of thing. Oh, that's really cool. We don't need it, but still. Maybe we'll have one in another building or something like that. We do still seem to have a backlog of... Did I see a brow? I say one thing, no, I didn't. Okay. Thing. 
Yeah, we still seem to have a backlog of people trying to get into all of these rooms. Let's get some more benches in. Oops, I'm gonna have to move that. Ah, no. Oh, no. That one. Get that there. Can I get a bookcase? Not quite. Can get a plant in there, though. Don't need one. All right. Sweet. Let's middle out that leaflet stand. There we go. All right, so we need to promote six staff, train six staff. Stop facilities are out of bounds for all patients mm. and some staff. Are we missing... We're missing, like, a deluxe click, I guess? I haven't seen any deluxe patients, though. But I guess we should probably have one all the same. So let's get one built. We've got $185,000, so we are not even remotely struggling for cash here. I'm actually going to move this here, I think. Because i got a window there. There we go. And this looks like it might need more space than I'm really giving it. Oh no. Oh no, that's a bad sound. Let's get you on the corner here. There we go. Let's get two fire extinguishers. I don't know where the door's gonna go. I guess the door's gonna go right there. Bins will become full. Maintenance announcement. Bins will become full. Good to know. I right, might surround this with uh, buildings, so I'm not going to put in more windows than I've got. Get a bin there. Get some plants. We're going to lose this one here. It's going to get recycled. Definitely need the lightheadedness poster right behind that. And they can look at the time as well. Plants need water, guys. Who knew? There we go. Yes. Alright, so we've got the Deluxe Clinic. I don't think I need to hire staff for it because I haven't seen anyone with bulbs. So, ooh, staff promotion. Absolutely. Let's do that. Uh, publicity update. We actually impressed our VIP with a nice hospital and they gave us reputation and kudosh. Nice. Staff challenge from Dave Pucker. Earn a 100,000. We're only earning 30,000 right now. Seems unreasonable. I'm going to reject it. Hmm. How is three GP's offices too much? Jeez. Hmm. Really struggling to get this backlog going. We also seem to be missing our uh, assistant, so let's get another one in there. Top class assistant. I'm assuming you are... Oh, you're a consultant on a call. On, on break. Oh, boy. I'm going to bump you to the front of the line because you look like you are dying. What your issue is, I do not know. Do we have uh, online challenges? Organization challenges. Complete... Compete with other healthcare organizations in a range of time challenges. Earn extra rewards, bragging rights by triumphing over your rivals. Take on rivals organizations from Two Point County or challenge hospitals owned by your Steam friends. Interesting. Each challenge takes place over a number of months. You can compete at the same time as your rivals or at separate times, and your results are recorded by the Two Point Competition Committee. You'll receive updates throughout the challenge on how each participant is doing each stage of the competition. That's kind of cool. I'm not going to bother with that just yet, though I don't think. Ooh, another promotion, and you can get a happy Salary buff. Uh, circus incident. Seven patients with chest infection. Seven. That seems excessive. But you know what? We're here to cure the ill. So they're going to enter this area here with chest infection. I guess what I want to do then is make sure that we've got enough benches to seat all of these guys. Oops. New tags on elbows. Yeah, if you're taxing my elbows, get out of here. Hmm. 
We might need some sort of reception area around here, but to be honest, we've run out of space to actually make that a possibility. So I need to stick around here just to make sure that the the emergencies that are coming in that they're getting treated first and foremost. It looks like they are. Oh my god, they're actually they're actually getting out of a clown car. That is beautiful. <laughs> oh boy. That's so cute. Bluish car for cubing. Good to know. All right, emergencies, get sorted. Should have like seven chairs worth of seating, hopefully. Plenty of entertainment, plenty of snacks and things like that to keep them occupied. I wonder if I can get more special stuff with my Qdosh. Get hand sanitizers, increases hygiene. Nice. Definitely want this arcade machine at some point. That seems a bit far off the drinking fountain magazine rack trophy case rosebush hmm I might save up for some of this stuff a doge painting oh maybe it's a famous dog <laughs> and a telephone oh provides entertainment all calls will be recorded for our amusement <laughs> ooh training yeah, let's get this guy trained. Nurse Benjamin Sausage. You currently have diagnostics. What can I train you in? Mm, you get stamina training, I suppose. Yeah, it seems reasonable. Train someone else as well in stamina. Let's see, who else? Ava Courgette. I don't want to take too many people off of um, their job, so I might spread out doctor, nurse, and janitor, just so I'm not taking like all of the doctors out in one go, because obviously I do need to sort this stuff out. Oh my god, there's uh, quite the backlog. 36 days in and we've still got plenty of, plenty of emergency guys waiting oh yeah let's check the maintenance on some of our stuff we could probably actually upgrade it as well get some of this stuff upgraded when we can is this an upgradable no not sure what is uh upgradable other than some of the machines like this if i can afford it though i absolutely should is in trouble again Apparently elixir your lady's yeah, I could upgrade that as well. So I've got so much money, I might as well, right? I don't know if we're going to be able to finish this one. We're halfway through and we've still got a ton left. We really probably needed a double clown clinic, I think, in order to make this happen. I mean, I could just, like, build another one real quick. I think I will, because it is like the focus of this map, so it seems like something I should really have more than one of anyway. Let's get a cannon in here. Uh, fire extinguisher. Did I get a fire extinguisher in here as well? I didn't. This one needs one. Let's get two in there. Safe than sorry and all that. Automated snack machines need restocking manually. There we go. Uh, let's get some plants in here. Let's get a certificate of comedy excellence. Nice clock in there. Oh yeah, of course we want the clown poster. Uh, let's get the clown poster in there. This one needs one as well. There we go. So we want to hire another nurse. Uh, ward management, don't really need that. Treatment and pharmacy management. I like treatment, but I can just get that one on Osman Radical. So let's get you in here. Hopefully we can spread that out and maybe in the last 20 days get that sorted. Excuse me, Osman Radical. 
I do believe I've asked you to remain in this room. Can I adjust where you go? Doesn't look like it, but actually we're going to maybe be able to manage this all the same, it seems. Which is good. And we do have an emergency dude in there as well. I didn't see you. So we've got two more, ten days to do it. Yeah, we should be fine. Okay. Still a crazy backlog on our GP's office. And now we actually have one on psychiatry as well. Dang. I might, like, train a super psychiatrist, perhaps. Oh. Oh. No health depleted. Well, that sucks. Ah, ah, ah. You should be at the front of the queue. Why did you... End of year oh. The dehumifier. <laughs> oh, my God. All right, ward ceremony time. We should probably get more stuff except for no deaths. Maybe not best teaching hospital, though I have been focusing on that a little bit more. Let's have a look-see. Oh, we did get it, nice. Sweet. What was that? Hannibal Beardsley. I love the names, it's so good. And we got a staff promotion as well. Let's bump you up. Three more that we need to get now. We've missed our last uh, Barnaby and Barney Pong. We missed you. Unfortunately. And all because our Janet decided to come in and repair the thing. Could I have just told you to stop, maybe? I don't know. You shouldn't have been doing it anyway. So it looks like we've actually... Three out of seven. Ugh. We actually lost reputation for that. I didn't realise we were failing them as often as that. Huh. Yeah, I definitely should have had uh, two clinics ready to go. It's a, a long procedure, I guess. And yeah, let's get you promoted with your weird glitchy face. Hmm, our first bug. Alright, what's this? Ah, oh, it's the inbox of all my messages, I see. Yeah, I'm thinking we need another GP's office. All three of them have got a severe backlog. So, let's get that sorted. We also probably need another janitor as well, because all of these plants are dying. Then again, I don't really need these anymore, so... You know, ooh, oh, I see you. Let's get these sold. They were here to complete a mission that was counting a room that I hadn't really put any uh, kind of effort into. Cure 10 patients. What's the challenge? <laughs> Doesn't sound like one to me. Who is our mime getting uh, told about the things that aren't real? Ooh. Mm. No! Doctor required an inflator room! Let's get a GP's office! Number four. Because they're very important. Let's get some filing cabinets at the back. This guy wants a lamp so he can read at night. Bookcase there. I want a bin. I love the customization in this game. I don't think I've really mentioned that too much, but being able to just fully customize out an area is so cool. Let's get a clock right up at behind the door. I don't want that underneath there. We. There we go. Because in case it falls, guys, it'll fall in the bin, and that's just not cool, right? Hmm. Let's get some posters in here as well. He's got to look important like he knows what he's talking about, so let's get all the special posters in. 
Uh, and invalid items. Oh. This lamp is being blocked. Yeah, okay, so I need to shift this slightly. There we go. Boom. Oh, we're hit level 10 now. Sweet. Alright, that should help with our bo backlog a little bit. Pookie syrup. Nah, I think we're at a point now where we can get some really high quality staff. Staff training required? Yeah, we'll train you. Uh, junior janitor. So we do have a head janitor, don't we? Yeah, you. And we obviously, I feel like we want to train ghost capture because that's one really nice skill. Especially as we've just created a ghost. Hmm. I wonder if I want to edit this area out, delete the reception desk and actually just build a reception in this area. We'd lose some seating, but we would gain probably the ability to more efficiently deal with incoming patients. Gotcha. Psychiatry also looks like it needs a bump in uh, productivity, so maybe around the corner here we'll actually build another psychiatry wall, uh, area. Is our, our staff room's probably just fine, but maybe we'll want a little one down here somewhere. 69% staff morale. Get in. All right. Um, yeah, let's get another psychiatry. Let's build it somewhere along here. I guess we'll make it nice and long. We're going to put something here, like a mini staff room, I guess. Um, let's get you in there. Oh, hello. Staff challenge. We'll get to that in a second. Firstly, I want to sort this out. Where do we want this couch? Let's get it there, I guess, and then and talk to him like that. I really want the, the fireplace. Unfortunately, it's 300 kudosh, and we don't quite have that. This guy, though, has all the certificates. He's a, he's a mad genius. Look at that. Look at all those, those qualifications he has. Inty crazy. Okay, and then let's have a clown poster here as well, even though it's not the uh, the place for it. Let's get a plant there. Get a plant in this corner. Hmm. Let this guy know what time it is. It's curing time. And then let's get some bookcases along the side. Something in the middle there definitely seems like a good idea. A bin. Uh, some windows. Can't forget those. Even though they are awkwardly placed. There we go. There's our next psychiatry area. So we need a... I think we've got a doctor already trained in psychiatry. So we don't really have to worry about that. Correct. Doctors. We've got two psychiatrists. You're currently on a break, and then you are currently te teaching psychiatry. Yeah, we have plenty of people in psychiatry, so I don't need to hire anyone else, I don't think. Let's get a tiny staff room. Do my radio. Let's get you in there. Little staff room. Seems just fine to me. Recently. I was impressed by how experimental the acts were till I realized it was facing the wrong way and just looking at the tent wall. Let's get a, a bookcase. This is a reading chair, of course. There we go. Um, let's get in the corner over here some cheesy gubbins and some burp. We do need a sofa. So let's get that sorted. Can't quite get one in there. This is only supposed to be a small area anyway, so... Let's just treat it as such. Hmm. 
I don't like this chair because it stares at the back of the television. And that seems like not something anyone wants to do. So maybe I'll shift this over a little bit. And then maybe rotate this slightly. Like so. And then we can have an armchair here. So we can all watch the television. Ah. Get a bin. Try to look healthy, guys. Don't you dare not look healthy in my hospital. Oh, I like this little area. It's nice and cozy. Definitely need a clock because they need to be reminded that they have to stop taking breaks. There we go. Oh, it's so cool. Ooh, what are you? What's up with you? You're only just seeing a GP? This seems terrible. We also need to fill this area up with some more benches and things like that. So let's do that. Get some benches in here. Uh, let's get that there. Something in that corner. Be a plant. Yeah. This beauty is looking quite good. Uh oh. I'm hearing a lot of deaths. This game seems very hard to avoid death. Very hard indeed. Let's get a uh, some posters along the sides. But I feel I feel like most of this game is all about the uh, the fun customization side of it, which I am digging. But this game is going to get so so hard. Shoot five mono beasts in 180 days. Yeah, I can do that. I've been doing that just randomly on occasion. So let's get you promoted. Actually, we've completed one of the objectives. Fifty thousand. Oh, you are a senior consultant though. Yeah, definitely going to bring you in. But I might have to let you go soon enough because you might be uh, getting a little cocky with the amount of money you're asking for. I can train you as well. Let's train you in... What do I want to train you in? I wonder if I could train you in something we don't already have. Bedside manner. What have you got at the moment? Treatment. Treatment skill. I guess I could just up your treatment. And we'll have to bring in a guest trainer, but that should be fine. Because she can then probably train my staff in that particular task. Still earning 33,000. What's your dig? What's your deal? You're queuing for the pharmacy. Okay. Ugh, some spoopy ectoplasm. So she's actually waiting to be cured. Anybody else who's... Oh, we got our VIP in the area. The Barbershop Quartet. There's been an art outbreak of Mockstar after a recent spike in polite and positive responses to karaoke performances. The families of the afflicted are sending them for treatment. We'll be rewarded if we treat this group. What should we do? They need to be sent to psychiatry and we have two psychiatrists. So yeah, four patients seems easy. The now They're here. Oh, no, that's the, uh, that's the guest. Water. Come on, janitors. We've got ghost problems. Yet again, we're still stuck with... Here's our mock stars. <laughs> oh, I love the teeth. It's so good. They've done a really good job of specifically this one, but... Really, all of the illnesses are so cool. Like monobrow, and they take it off, and it just starts crawling around the hospital. In fact, did I just see one? No. It's making me on edge now, because I actually need to shoot them pretty consistently. But if we're not getting any, then there's a problem. This corridor is looking a little lacking. In cardiology. Yeah, it needs something down there. Let's get a plant or two. There we 
There we go. Alright. And we are going to need some benches in this area as well. I did forget about that. Especially since we've got people coming in. Need to make sure that they're uh, properly seated. Can I get a bench in this corner here? I can. I can get one off to the side here, but I'm not happy about it. Okay, so health of all of our people. Everybody should be green. You are not. Sometimes you end up getting the problem where... I think the main issue with our people dying is that they're actually um, hitting this backlog of GPs. But, I mean, three GPs offices seems like we should have it covered. You need to be bumped to the front of the queue. We should have people come into this one and people come to this one as well. Yeah, these guys are all queuing here. Is there a way I can tell people to move to a different one? I'm not quite sure. I'll have to look that up. Hmm. Yeah, I'd like it if I could split my uh, patients between my two psychiatrists. I think I had one over here, but really should be two and two. Pocket watches are a thing of the past. Hmm. Train three more staff members. We're about to train one more, so we need to train two more people. And then we got a two-star two hospital. Bungle rocket watch. Ooh, treatment. Nice. Okay, so. Let's get some training done. Need to train two more people. Let's get... Let's do like um, a janitor training thing, I guess. So, trainers available. I want that mechanics too, I think. Um, head janitor with mechanics too. Train my other janitors in mechanics, please. Um, train you. Train you. You know what? Train you. Get training. Oh, you can only do motivation? Really? Why? Well, get motivated. That'll uh, complete my two-star hospital once that's all done and everybody will be motivated, so no issue there. Um, we're missing a doctor because he's off on his break, so I guess we'll need a backup doctor. Get you in here. There we go. I can't really afford to not have my GP's offices manned at all times. If I can help it. Oh my gosh, would you look at the time. I've been going about 15 minutes longer than I actually should have done. So thank you very much for watching, guys. We're going to leave it off here. I do hope you've enjoyed. If you have, then be sure to hit that like button and subscribe for some more in the future as well. And I will see you all next time, probably for a brand new hospital, because once this training's done, we'll actually have completed this level and we'll be moving on to the cold area, so that should be fun. All right, guys, thank you very much for watching. See you later.